The car hit the fire department's EMT captain so violently it smashed the vehicle's windshield and sent him flying through the air. A man who was focused on the safety of firefighters ended up needing medical help himself. We had two uh, firefighter minor injuries, and uh, they were taking care of our men. And when, they, and when he was leaving, walking back to the ambulance, he was struck by the civilian vehicle. Everyone's attention was focused on the fire scene, but some cars were still moving around the equipment here on Riverdale Avenue. The officer was hit right in front of the Sunoco station over there. The surveillance cameras caught it on tape. You can see him come into frame from the left. He's headed to the ambulance parked across the street. The Volkswagen hits him from behind. Suddenly, he's the emergency. It was unbelievable. EMS and uh, uh, emergency medical service to get hit by a car. That's Where's the irony there? Wow. I saw the guy, one of the firefighters, saying, stop, stop. So then I turned around full way, and then I saw the guy getting hit by the car. Is he hurt bad? How did he look? He looked. He said, oh, my back, my back, and then he just laid down on the floor. The driver here is identified as 40-year-old Jay Friedenberg of Greenwich, Connecticut, charged tonight with failure to yield to an emergency vehicle and driving on the wrong side of the street. He had no comment this evening, but is clearly lucky the man he hit wasn't more seriously injured.